Shifting our focus to South Africa, where the death toll from the devastating flood that has hit Durban and its surrounding areas has now risen to over 300, with many people continuing to remain missing. This region hasn't seen rain like this in more than 60 years. 448 people are dead, with dozens still missing. Recovery workers with dogs searching for bodies. 40,000 South Africans now displaced, more than 4,000 homes destroyed. This is a sorrowful moment for the people of South Africa, especially the families that are still mourning their loved ones. When I arrived, when I came back to the, from, the clinic. from the clinic, was a little bit early, like eight up to half past nine. Yeah. As I arrived, I said, all the community was there with the, the, the two bodies, <coughs> my wife and my son. Do you know how many people passed on? They're still looking for people, but around my area it was like 200 that were dead. You all know that I declared the year 2022 as a year of charity and the flood victims right here in Deban City will not be left out. We found someone who lives in the township where the flood happened, but her house was not affected. How many places were affected in here? Almost every place. It just depends on how bad um, the situation was. But your house was not affected? No, it was not. So she took us to the camp allocated by the government for the people that homes were destroyed during the flood. When we got there, we made a caretaker of the place and she told us that the people living here right now needs two things. That is food and accommodation. And what our strength can do for now was the foodstuffs. But with accommodation, I think we're gonna do it together. As a family, we're gonna put our strength together to build a home for them. Where, where do you live now? I live in on top there. From the neighbors. neighbors you yeah. don't have a place to stay now. Sorry? You don't have a place to stay for your no, own. No, we haven't got a place. We both have, I think, over like 1.4 million subscribers. We will put a GoFundMe link down in the, in the description below. We'd like to build in a house. Um, I just want to let you guys know something. Tayo and I are not doing this to show off, but it's something that we're doing just to inspire you. For me, if I'm not a YouTuber, like you would never see me doing anything like this on camera. But since I have audience, I have people like you who watch my videos all the time, I'm just trying to tell you that giving is not a crime. I will give just to inspire you to go out there and give that little amount of money to put smiles on people's faces. You know what? Do you guys want to shop with me? Or have you checked the link in the description? Click on it. If it's a dollar, let's donate it and give it back to the society. They need us. We are all Africans. It's Africans that are suffering. And I believe that you and I, as Africans living in different parts of Africa, can come together and support our own. The time is now. Thank you. This one. one more. We're given 15 items to buy, and on the list there is tissue, so we gotta just take That's all. You don't know, right? Alright. It's a South African's love chicken feet. Are you buying it for yourself or you're buying it for them? No, for I saw them. The, I saw the way you've been packing chicken. chicken. <laughs> you've been packing too much chicken. <laughs> Don't go and take it to your house. Uh, 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 where, where I live, I cannot even cook, man. Salbona. They said candles and matches. Okay. Apparently, where they live, there is no electricity. 
so they need candles and matches. And I'm well, pleading with the government, man. I mean, electricity is something that I think each and every South African needs to have, right? So I guess maybe we're just gonna buy this today. But I think maybe if you see this video, make it happen, yeah? Let them get electricity in there. Hey, yeah, yeah. Why are you holding it like that? Why, why are you holding it like that? Bro, you, this, this is, this why, is from, why is he holding it like that? Is it made in Congo? They chop it with the. Is it made in Congo? They chop it. They chop it. They chop it. <laughs> Man, which I. Oh, let me ask you. You know, we cannot have a serious conversation all the time. Which African country men do you think have this one? <laughs> Leave that in the comment section. We want to know. Nigeria. Ah, no. I think Congo will win. Ah, how do you know? <laughs> Ty, I, I want to know why is this so important to you? It's important because you know we're all Africans and if one African is going through a problem, then all Africans are going through that same problem. And if we can lend a helping hand to help people, then we should. So you know what? It's time for you to join the movement. We are doing our part, so you also have to do your part. The link will be in the description. But yo, Ty is amazing, man. I mean, if you're watching this video and you have not subscribed to Ty Aina, what are you waiting for? He makes the dopest African yeah, vlogs. <laughs> yeah, yeah, hey, Omo, let me let me finish. Now. Let me finish. No let me finish no now. He makes the best African travel vlogs. Go check out the description box. Subscribe to his YouTube channel. You watch my videos. Take me, to, take me back to Ghana with you. <laughs> I, I should take you to Ghana. Yeah. Really? I hear Ghana is the best country in Africa right now. <laughs> How did you know? I watch a lot of vlogs from Ghana. <laughs> You know what, nice, I, to, nice to see you. Nice to see you. Just yeah, a quick yeah. question. You're from Devon. Uh -huh. I'm from Devon, yeah. You heard about what happened? The the, the flats. Yes, yes, yes. How bad it is? It's very bad. People are devastated because they've lost income, they've lost money, they've lost a whole lot of stuff. The homes, lives. It's bad. So you know so sad and I didn't know anything about it. Yeah. Once I arrived in Durban, mm. and then a lot of people were saying this is the wrong time to be in Durban because yeah. I mean a lot of lives have been no, lost. No, you know what? I think the mood is low. Um, everybody's mood is not that great. But I think if you go to certain parts of Durban, you'll be you'll be fine. If I had time, I would have definitely joined you guys because I love your videos, my guy. I just wanted to shake your hand and know that. I've met this guy <laughs> in, my, in, in my life once, so... I mean, yeah. Africans are watching, what are you going to tell them? No, I'm just... Um, it's one Africa. Um, one Africa, yeah. That's it? Yeah, we, we're all together. This thing of um, people complaining, saying we are xenophobic, and people saying that... Uh, I mean, we all, we all won. We all won. I love yeah. you, bro. Yeah. Thanks, my brother. Thanks Thank my you. Brother. Yeah, yeah, Thank yeah. you. Nice to meet you. All right, man. Yeah, nice yeah. to meet you, too. It's time to pay for the bills, but we are lined up right now. It's like the person who is coming to serve us is like, what is going on? This is too much for one person. Yeah, but we're gonna feed about 198 yeah. people. 198. So I don't think this is this is not enough, but we are doing our part. Yeah. Omo Omo Niger Omo Niger. Hey, I got my brother from Ghana, man. What are you gonna tell them, man? Well. We are here to support a brother, we are happy, you know. We are doing this together. It's a great feeling, you know. It, it, I feel like it feels good to put smiles on people's faces. Yeah, yeah. you know. Oh, oh. You are in South Africa. I'm in South Africa. I'm, I'm everywhere, you know. How are you? <laughs> nice to meet you too. Yeah, yeah you, you, you're from here? Yeah, from here. From Deba. From where? From Burundi. Burundi? Oh, nice. I follow you. Nice. It's good to see you. Wow. See, before I let you go, you're missing two Africans. <laughs> <laughs> you see yourself. They must you're keep following you, listening to what you are doing. You are doing a great job. My go to this side. Publishing the, the continent. Yeah. We need more of that. So the youth will know that uh, it's not all, only about uh, going in America or everywhere. Even here in Africa, you can make it. Here in Africa, yeah, you, can, you make can make it. it. Yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs> 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 I see you. 
love about South Africa is that even in the malls when you're filming, no one is coming to you to tell you that stop filming. Where I'm coming from, even your phone, you can't use it. Hi. You can't use your phone. You can't use your phone. They will tell you that stop filming me. But you just say, say hello to them. Hello. Oh, I, I told you, yeah. The South Africans are the nicest people you'll ever meet, man. Oh my goodness. Well, this, this is the South Africa that most of you have never been seeing on TV. So yeah, she's representing the real South Africa. <laughs> We, Dayo, we, we ended up tasting it, eh? Uh, very nice. <laughs> I, I don't charge this one. No, yeah, no, it's already checked it. Uh, so we started eating the food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, in an African home, if you're going to give something to somebody, you, you have to taste it first. Right, no, no. No. United Africans coming together to solve a problem. So listen, this car belongs to a Ghanaian and this car right here belongs to my brother from Nigeria. And you know, she's from Swaziland. Come on, say hi. Hi. And we are all from different African countries coming to, together to solve one problem here. Yeah. They decided to bring their cars, support us. We aren't even buying the food. Like I, I'm like, why are they doing this? And they just said one thing, we are all African. So listen, if we unite as one, we can do a lot of things here. Yeah. I, I keep on telling you guys that two Africans, three Africans can come together to solve a problem. Enough of doing things individualism, you know, it's, it's, it doesn't take us anywhere. I'm so emotional, I don't wanna cry because men don't cry, but yeah. You don't men don't cry. Do you wanna cry, bro? Yeah, I just cried yesterday. For what? A woman broke your heart? <laughs> you have to be a woman. Because <laughs> that's the only time men cry, man. Yeah. yeah anyway, true. I'll see you guys when we get there. Man. So we finally got here. This is the place where the people that has been displaced by the flood are living right now. I think this is the place that was provided by the government, right? Yes. So, who are the people that live in here? It's the um, citizens. Citizens that, that were affected by the flood, yes. right? So people living here don't have a place to stay. The flood wiped off their houses. Identity documents, everything. They have nothing. They have nothing? Yeah. So this is where they stay. Yes. So the things that we got, that is when we're gonna bring it to them. You know, me. So, oh, you wanna help me? Don't know they are. Ah, thank you, my brother. Thank you. Thank you. You guys have some more here? Yeah, I think in the seat. In the seat. Thank you. Thank you so much. Abundantly bless you. Thank you so much. Let me help carry that. This one is heavy. Can you carry it? It's just yes. bread. Just bread. This one I will help you they carry. They carry buckets on top of their ah, just head. like that. Just like that. Mm. You know, when we used to go and fetch water in the village, oh. this is how we carry the water. One here and one there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, come with me. Let's go. Means we've got so many women living in here. 108. 108. 108. 108. 108. 
So which means as the, everybody lives here, there is no privacy here. There's not, as you can see, there's no privacy at all. Where did they sleep then? Point of correction, guys. Yeah. This is okay. our sister. Uh -huh. okay. This is our sister. You, I can, I can, I am like. This is our very important <laughs> sister. We love her from our bottom of our hearts. We have to say thank you to her, cause all those things, all this food we having, she's the one who's making this. I'm not going to forget my brother. <laughs> Guys, we really appreciate it. This is nice. I can't even mention the name of him. So guys, thank you very much. Thank you guys. We are appreciated. Everything that you have done for us. Even our volunteers. Thank you guys. We love you all. So, there's nothing much I can say. I'm going to cry. <laughs> like this put smiles on people's faces and we can do this together so I just want you to understand that this is just one place and there are so many places in here that we can do together with them we can raise funds for them thank you thank you yeah from Ghana Organization or just no, 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 organization. no, organization. That's no, 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 do something and then we'll go back so tomorrow. Kind of you think <coughs> yeah, I mean, we're all Africans, yeah? yeah. So we need to support. Oh, God will bless you guys. Thank you very much. Uh, I didn't get your name. And My name is Maya. 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 Thank yeah. you, Maya. And Maya. your name is? Maya. 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 Thank you very much, guys. We really appreciate your heart. Okay. Lot. From people who were displaced by the flood, right? But the people that lost their family because of, uh, I mean, some of them are going through tra trauma, right? So because of that, they can't stay in there. So we are actually on our way to go and meet someone Thank who you. lost family members. I hope I don't fall, man. This was created by the flood. Yeah. Water is so cold. It rained at night or in the morning? What up past nine? At night. Night. Yes. So they were sleeping? Yes, they were sleeping. So, uh, I need to show you the place where, where we found them, the mother and the... This is the house. We found them there, next to the blue thing. Dead? Yes. The water was running through all the, we found them deep down inside the sand. So the, how many people were in the house when it happened? Two people? No, there were four. Two of them, or they are alive. Two of them, they are dead, mother and the son. They just break the wall and come out just to save, cause she, they heard the mother, uh, the wife screaming. They said, oh, my son, my son. Then they took the brick, to break. try to, yes, to try to break some, they are already on the down. Yes. As you can see, it's wet here. Yeah. They, they are so resting perfectly. So they are buried already. Yeah, they are. Yes. Yeah. This is their toilets. They, they were using this toilet. There's the line. That's the 
when they are hanging your clothes. This, yeah, as you can see. So is, is anybody building the home for him again? No, from now he's living on the neighborhoods. Oh, he's coming, he, she, she's calling him just now. So yeah. you can speak to him. I think, I mean, that would be better for us to, if we have to do anything, we have to maybe, if we talk to him, we can actually build for him rather. Balamini, I just want to say sorry for your loss. Okay. And uh, we know how you feel right now. Mm. But um, can you tell us what really happened? Yeah, I was was a Monday last night. Uh, when I'm just to sleeping. Uh, Two rooms was falling down with these two two big rocks was coming on a on a boundary here for my neighbor. Mm. As I start to sleeping, the wall was falling down. Falling all down. Of, yeah. So the wall did the wall fall on you? All of us, because me I was on a kitchen on a I just sleeping on a sofa. On the couch. On a couch, yeah. Uh, my wife and my son and, uh, the, other and son. the other son was on a room, on a bedroom. And the other bedroom? Yeah, other bedroom. As uh, the wall is falling down, I'm just shouting, hey, we're just dying now. I see the small child, that one was here, this little one, was on a brick here, it's, the head was inside the bricks and then the bricks was pushing like this. I just moving the, the bricks on me and then I just pulling my last son on the bricks. As I pulling the last son on the bricks, I, there's another one there. He, he's crying there, hey Baba, just grab me. I try to grab that son, but I never feel it. I just touching on his hands like this. I just remove all the all the rocks and the and the bricks. <clears throat> As I moving all the rocks and the bricks halfway, I just to pull him like this. Hey, it doesn't come. I just keep running to knock on my neighbors because my neighbors was can't hear nothing because because of the rain. I just knock door to door. I got uh, three guys. One for there, for that uh, grey house, one for other side, this side, and my neighbor on top here. It's just helping me. We're starting to try to pull out, out this one, this son. Uh, since uh, 10 up to 3, it doesn't come out. As we're pulling out, is inside the hole. The, this rock, we just waiting with the with the with the spade, because if we if it is moving, it's gonna go down. Go down with the yeah. mm. On here, as we pulling this one, on here, no one shouting yet. With my wife and my son, wasn't shout. As we finish to pull out this one, I say, hey, there's another two. Over there. Yeah, there's another two so, uh, people I here. Can't see them. Yeah. So yes. this one, you uh, managed to pull. Yeah, we managed where, to where, pull. Where him. is he now? He's there. He's sitting there. He's no, oh. on top there. The one who bro broke his leg. Broken uh, broken leg. Yeah. Yeah, hey, yeah. yeah, the one who broke his leg. Mm. So go back and then. And then I take him to, to the clinic. To the clinic. As I take him to the clinic, the, my neighbors in the community, com community so I just, can't see my wife. Can you please just search for my wife and my son? Yeah, it just, I'm taking them to the hospital this one. Mm. When you arrive, 
when I arrived, when I'm coming back to the, from, the clinic. from the clinic, was a little bit early, like eight up to half past nine. nine. Yeah. As I arrived, I said, all the community was there with the, the, the two bodies. <coughs> my wife and my son. I taking my dead son to Arkekan. Coming back later, hey, where I can sleep? I just go to my neighbor's place. So where, where do you live now? I live in on top there. The neighbors. My neighbors. You don't have a place to stay now. Sorry? You don't have a place to stay for your no, own. No, we haven't got a place. Um, Tyro, I think um we can build a house for you. Yeah. yeah? Okay, Baba. Maybe it's a Bangaguakela almost when we fish a ganjan, when we are fisher or Kobega Wakela, Baguakele, and the Clapper of Kelling down. I am suffering so bad. He doesn't want you to rebuild the house. No, 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 we can't. We, 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 we won't rebuild this one from somewhere else. Yeah. Okay. So just somewhere else. Okay. So, um, we're going to do this. Uh, Ty, I think, um, ha. Huh. I feel so emotional. Yes. Wait, wait a minute. Okay, you can go ahead, man. Let's, let's just... Ty, mm -hmm. just take over, take over. Just... Yeah, like, being here and, you know, hearing the story, I'm sure as you guys know, as you're watching, it's like, it's really sad. And we can find a way to kind of, like, help out. I know nothing, nothing we're going to do is going to bring back the people who are already gone, but... At least people who are still living, we can find a way to help them. So we both have, I think, over like 1.4 million subscribers. We will put a GoFundMe link down in the, in the description below. We'd like to build in a house somewhere else in Durban so that at least you can start again, you can have a new home and start again. I'm, I'm, I'm like I'm like short of words. I know, I, I know, just, I know. So I just um, again, let's let's just do this together. Um, I, I believe that after this video, we're gonna talk, and then I'm gonna tell you how much both of us can put together ourselves, and then uh, we set the example so that you guys will follow. Uh, I'm gonna come back here again just for this project. We're making sure that we build before we get out of there, man. Yeah, you say if you want to say something. Uh, guys, thank you very much for your support, and we hope that soon you're going to do something better in you. Cause now they don't have clothes for him and to his sons, and the more thing that's worrying us, the place to sleep. They're sleeping from neighbors. I don't know if they have food or they don't have food. So, guys, we need you just to be put together. Like, now we're like family. Yeah, definitely. One, and one hand touch another, so we can come together as one. We okay. thank you very much, guys. Thank you so much for, thank thank you for your coming, uh, coming here with us. Um, thank sorry you, Baba. You, thank you, sorry for your loss, yeah? Mm -hmm. We'll come back again. Hi, ha, you watch my videos? I'm like, this guy is here and he's just said, what am I? Hi, what's your name? Okay. Fundi, how old are you? How old are you? 16. Which video did you watch? I watched, I forgot, but I, I know you. You know me? <laughs> All right, interested, man, let me. You have my bag, eh? Give me my bag. That's the that's the boy who watched my videos, man. Take it, eh? You should share. I, I've given all the money to you. 